Hi. Welcome to CalCare. Today, we will going to talk about Project Planner and its features. Later in this video, I'm going to show you a quick demo of how to use the Project Planner application. You can do project management without becoming a project manager. Learning the fundamentals of project management will help you manage your job more effectively, whether you're a freelancer, in-house manager, or someone who has just taken on a managerial position. The method used to plan, track, control, and report on a project is called project management. Each project has a defined beginning and ending date. A project also generates a certain deliverable. To generate the necessary outcome and satisfy stakeholder expectations, project managers must plan and carry out a project with the project team. The use of procedures, techniques, abilities, knowledge, and experience to accomplish particular project goals in accordance with predetermined guidelines is known as project management. Final deliverables in project management are subject to time and financial constraints. Project management stands out from simple management in large part because it has a final product and a set amount of time, unlike management, which is an ongoing process. A project manager therefore needs a diverse set of abilities, including many technical ones, as well as unquestionably those related to managing people and having a solid understanding of business. What is Project Planner? An Excel program called Project Planner was created for project management. It can produce automated Gantt chart and S-curve with slippage report. It has also other PM tools such as critical path analysis, deterministic approach and a probability analysis for both beta and triangular distribution. In addition to that, Project Planner comes with textbook like network diagram. Project Planner contains both planned and actual rows of activity. Project Planner has a very important features as listed below. Completely redesigned graphical user interface. Simple and easy to use. Take the sting out of time-consuming project management. Continually stay on track. Report slippage. Know if the project is behind the schedule or ahead of the schedule. Automatic generation of Gantt chart and S-curve for both planned and actual activities. Can perform critical path analysis, CPA, single-time and three-time estimates. Can perform probability analysis for both beta and triangular distribution. Can perform a textbook like network diagram. Design workflow is easy to follow. Dynamic. Unique. Well-documented. Affordable. The graphical user interfaces were created because command line interfaces were quite complicated and it was difficult to learn all the commands in it. Project Planner interface is designed to simplify your workflow. The graphical user interface of the software We have ribbons, project signatories, project activities and scheduling windows, Gantt chart and S-curve window. Tabs and toolbars are part of the ribbons. The tabs of Project Planner include File, Tools, View, Analysis, and Help. A frequently used function for project scheduling is found under Toolbars. Save the project, clear the project, calculates the amount for every activity, calculates the weight and percentage for every activity, initialize the program. Click this icon to perform project scheduling, minimize Gantt chart and S-curve window. Autofit columns only based on its working Gantt chart, view Gantt chart and S-curve window, open the display layout dialog for printing and tracking, blue theme workspace and black theme workspace. Clear, Open, Save, Save As, Close, and Exit are available on the File tab. Open Calculator, Open Notepad, Watch Window, and Add Comment are all available under the Tools tab. Date Reference, Activity List, Monitoring and Planned Activities are all available under the View tab. Perform Project Management, Amount Calculation, Weight Calculation, Other PM Tools and Print Options are all available under the Analysis tab. About software, developer and show height help comment are all available under the help tab. Under view tab, we have date reference. After choosing date reference, a new console will appear as shown.
We have activity list. Selecting activity list, a new console will appear as shown. By default, plan and actual activities are already shown in the main workspace. Selecting planned activities will hide all the actual rows of activities in the main workspace. Selecting monitoring will show the actual rows of activities for monitoring the project. Under other PM tools are critical path analysis, normal probability distribution analysis, and network diagram. By choosing critical path analysis, a new console will appear as shown. A project management technique called critical path analysis, also referred to as critical path planning, assesses the time required to perform various activities and determines the quickest course of action. To perform critical path analysis, you must first make a list of all tasks needed to complete the project, give each task a length, and then identify which tasks are dependent on finishing the tasks that came before them. With this knowledge, you can create a chart of your activities and identify the dependent task chain that is the longest. By choosing Normal Probability Analysis, a new console will appear as shown. Probabilistic Time Estimates, also known as Probabilistic Activity Time Approach, refer to a method under Project Evaluation Review Technique, PERT, which predicts and estimates accomplishment duration of events or activities in operations by an approach called Three Time Estimates. This approach facilitates the calculation of mean and variance of the beta distribution of time of each activity. It is assumed that beta distribution is an efficient way to approximate activity duration. Beta distribution in graphical representation is continuous and seems like bell-shaped curvature in skewed form. By choosing Network Diagram, a new console will appear as shown. The network diagram is shown after mapping out the tasks and responsibilities, schedules, monitoring, and controlling to track the efforts being made. It consists of boxes or circles that represent tasks and arrows that indicate the order of those tasks, providing a clear picture of the right tasks and duties being performed at the right time and location. Let's talk a look at sample outputs of the Project Planner application. Now, let's watch this demo.